In this video, we're going to continue our conversation about the AC schematics. And we are going to pretty specifically deal with yet another motor schematic, everything controlled by cooling thermostat. And we have a, we're, all the difference is from this and the last schematic is we're adding a capacitor onto the compressor. We're going to make it a CSCR motor instead of a CSIR motor. So what we're dealing with is we have a shaded pole evaporator motor, we have a compressor with two capacitors and a potential relay as our start components, and then we have a condenser fan motor that's a, C, that's a PSC motor, permanent split capacitor. So I'm going to come out of here and I'm going to go ahead and connect in my thermostat. Okay. Um, then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to connect in my run cap. Actually, we're going to connect that to the thermostat. So I'm going to pull up a line there because I want to come to the evaporator fan. Let's get that in. Then I'm going to connect in my run cap. I'm going to connect in my start cap because my start cap is going to go to pin one. My run cap is going to come over here and is going to come down and connect right in to my run winding. My start cap will connect in there. Now the one we have to be careful about is pin 5. Okay, but let's go ahead and before I do anything with pin 5, let me go ahead and put in my um, L1 which I'm using as the common side doesn't really matter it's AC voltage so it doesn't matter if I connect it on common or line connected my commons I'm gonna connect my run cap in again goes to my start winding Okay, but we still have this pin 5. So pin 5 goes to common. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and bring this out here. Okay, so pin 5 is goes to common. So that is our pictorial. Now from this we need to do a ladder schematic. Now we've just done a ladder schematic based on um, let me just get that wire in there that's going to drive me nuts. So okay we did a ladder schematic based on a CSIR compressor a few minutes ago. So if we go back to this ladder schematic that we did for this CSIR we have the same diagram. We just need to add in here. I need a start cap in here. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to actually, I'm going to select my start cap. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to come back in here. I'm going to paste my start cap in. Or I need a run cap actually. So now I have a C because all remember all we did okay is change that capacitor start induction run all I've done is change that to a capacitor start capacitor run so let me just change this So we're going to change that to actually
So this is going to change to a CSCR motor. So we're going to just, I'm going to just take that, get rid of that. I'm going to change this just to a CSCR motor. Capacitor start, capacitor run. So this and this are now the same diagram. Again, pictorial is great for wiring and component placement. Ladder diagram is great for um, sequence of operation, good points for figuring out where what meter readings should be and stuff like that.